Hello guys, this is Shubhadeep. Welcome to my channel. So in this tutorial, we will talk about earlier function. How this function works? Let's see it. So here you can see this is our table. Okay, this is our sheet one table. So here you can see there is some product names. So cost year. I want how many times each products came. How many times each products came in this column? In this product name column okay so how it will see like this cost first row is cost so is there any any row as cost no one no rows only one row that is why it is counting as one year this product is coming how many times let's see one two two times that is why it is coming as two gh is coming two times that is why it is com counting as two kl this one this one and this one so KL is coming as three times that is why it is counting as three okay JH is one time so how it will work how we can make it let's see so here you can see I have created a calculated column that is count of product so how this logic works let's see it so earlier function what earlier function is doing it is going row by row and checking it if this product name occurred earlier if this product name occurred earlier and it is coming again if this product name occurred earlier and this is coming again if this if this logic happens then sum exit so sum x is what sum x is doing sum x is counting how much uh, the occurrence some x is counting the occurrence okay if this product name comes again if this product name was earlier and it is coming again then some exit this is the logic and if this whole logic works if this whole logic is true then it is one unless if it is false then it is zero okay so this is the whole logic so once again what is happening if this product name from sheet 1 table if this product name was earlier was earlier and the same product name is coming again then count it then sum it sum it up okay like this it is it happens okay this is the whole logic and if this logic works if this logic is true then 1 or else 0 so after that so here you can see so what we have to do go to their count of product and if i click do not summarize it will come in as like this okay so we will do as count okay it is coming nine total is nine here you can see total is nine like this we can calculate how many times in the same column how many times product is coming on uh, a distinct row is coming how many times we can calculate like this it is the earlier uh, earlier function by earlier function we can calculate it okay so this is that today's tutorial so if you like my work please like my channel please subscribe to my channel like my videos share it among your friends support to my work support to my channel thank you guys thank you